welcome to the Brighton Half Marathon. This is absolutely crazy difficult here today, but we're trying our best. We're gonna get it done. Brighton Half Marathon, 21.1k, around the streets of Brighton in the glorious spring sunshine here. We've been followed by about 9,000 other runners ready to go out and get it done today. Right, we'll see you out on the course in a bit. Good luck buddy. Right, hey, it's so windy here today. We've got a horrible headwind to deal with for the first few k's. So yeah, 2k in now, 7.09 so far, battling that wind. But yeah, we'll have the tailwind to enjoy very soon. Just coming out to 8k in, back into the centre of Brighton, and yeah, it'd be nice to have the wind behind us for a few k's now. And then we're gonna head through these crowds here and uh, up towards Preston Park where the Brighton Full Marathon starts. Right, let's take in some crowds. Woo! up in 35 13 on the watch yeah feeling all right but still not even halfway it's getting tough already but time to dig deep and give it a roll on the second half we're going to 15k in 53 minutes yeah in just making the most of this tailwind. It's gonna be awful on the way back. Just been thinking about it all the way. Can't get it out of my head. But that's why we put in the training miles for these tough times in races. But we have to deep dig at the end to get this done. Come on guys, like, share, subscribe. Let me know how you're running today. Your day will come. It's what you do in the tough days 
that makes those good days all that much better. A great day, time-wise, but a great day for, thank you, for building for the future and racing in tough conditions, character building. Well done to everyone out there today. If you ran, let me know what you thought of it. Great course, great support, and yeah, awesome event. Well done to everybody putting it on. Right, let's go find Sarah. <laughs> Just come up to watch the runners coming into the finish behind me here on Madeira Drive. And yeah, just such a beautiful sight after everything the world's been through. Back to normal, everyone's here running, no COVID restrictions, at least here in the UK now. The streets filled with runners, everybody cheering. It's just the most amazing sight. Kind of chokes me up a little bit inside just to see people out here doing what they do best. So yeah, if you're still struggling down the world, things will get better. But right here, right now, in Brighton, the UK, this is just the most amazing sight that we'll be so looking forward to over the last couple of years of everything. So yeah. Give yourself a massive pat on the back. Big kudos to everyone out there getting it done today. Just, oh, just brings tears to my eyes to see this. Let's have a little summary of the race. So I think we're at 60 miles, about 10k. We were on for about 1.14.30 in the half with 5k to go and then finished in 1.18 something. It just shows how, yeah, I did suffer probably more than most in that last 5k. I didn't have much to give. The wind was crazy, but we're not here to make those things. It's, it's annoying when runners just moan about wind and stuff. They were the conditions. We had a good effort, we didn't get our time. We were never going to get our time in those conditions and just enjoyed being out here having fun. So yeah, regroup, build, get back to Manchester. Got lots of fun sessions to do over the next few weeks. We've got two sessions to do next week. We're gonna take you along for those. Overall, I'm happy enough with that. <laughs> I'm not happy because I didn't get my time, but yeah, one of those things doesn't really matter we're just here and enjoying these incredible scenes about everybody out there getting it done right I'm gonna take in a few of these last shots I will see you in a bit so well done to everybody out there today awesome to see all these foil blankets glistening in the spring sunshine and yeah just awesome if you were out there smashing it getting it done big big respect well done to Marshall coming second and my friend Cole as well I think it came eighth just just incredible running in those conditions we'll put all the final results for the ladies and the men up on the screen now thank you to all the Patreon legends the supporters here on YouTube get your hats and get ready for racing in the spring all the spring races are coming up we've got all the new gear coming up we've got an amazing year of running and racing coming up here for all of you guys on the channel so lots of love hope you're well and we will see you in the next one.